You guys make some of the most common household products, and yet for so long, Mars was very private. Over the last few years, you guys have sort of come out and, and been more vocal. What sort of driving that recent shift? For most of our history, in fact, you know, 99% of our history chosen not to be in the public eye, and we've really wanted our, our brands to engage consumers. And uh, yet times have changed, and uh, really fundamentally, as much as anything, um, current and future associates really want to know the company that they're working for. What is the vision of this company? What does it stand for? Um, furthermore, the, there are so, a range of issues that are very serious, as you would know, facing the world uh, and, and are a threat, direct threat to our business if not addressed. Whether that's issues like climate change or uh, labor issues in our supply chain or diversity and inclusion or health and well-being, these are all really key issues that are, are significant uh, uh, challenges as well as opportunities to our business. We feel a responsibility to do our part in addressing them. And, uh, and part and parcel of being able to do that is to speak publicly about our stance on these issues and hopefully enroll others to work with us in a coalition to address them. Do you think uh, also consumers now are looking more for the company behind the brands? And has that had anything to do with you guys being more vocal as well? Yes, uh, the answer is consumers do want to know more about the, 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 not only the brands that they're buying, but the companies behind them. Do you think that being a private company gives you an advantage in any way to respond to you know, consumer sentiment? Being private does uh, give us a competitive advantage, mm -hmm. and, and it, does, uh, it does give us a competitive advantage in that we know who our shareholders are. Um, we could fit them all in, in quite a, a small room if we had to. <laughs> and so the ability of management to interface with, uh, with the shareholders is very direct. It's, it's, very, um, uh, it's very tangible. It's very immediate. And, and I think it does give us a capacity to make decisions quickly. When we decided to actually uh, make the acquisition of Wrigley, uh, it was a f very uh, uh, quick conversation with, with the shareholder body at large in order to, to make what was our largest acquisition in the totality of our history.